In order to use Radical Live and to connect it into Unity, you will first need the Radical plugin. You can find the plugin from our website under the Integrations drop down within the navbar. For the purpose of this tutorial, I will be showcasing on Unity 2022.3.f1 LTS. The plugin is a Unity package file, so it will need to be brought into a project, new or previously existing. For simplicity, I will create a project. The Radical plugin is intended to be used within Unity's Universal Rendering Pipeline, or URP. The plugin is compatible with other rendering pipelines, however, it could display visual artifacts during the runtime or within the editor. However, the live data streamed over into Unity will remain as intended across all rendering pipelines. Name your project what you like and launch Unity. To install, simply right click in the root of the content browser, import package, custom package. Alternatively, you can then drag the Unity package into the content browser from your file explorer. There, you'll be presented with checkboxes in which content to install. Don't untick anything and simply install the complete set. After a moment, you will find a root folder called Radical SDK. It is vitally important that you do not move this folder anywhere. To bring up the interface, navigate over to Radical SDK, Prefabs, Connector, Radical Connector, and drag the prefab into your scene. Select it within the inspector, and you will be provided with fields to input your information from Radical Cloud. With the plugin installed correctly, let's transition over to the Radical website to start a live session.